this is a quick video of how to change out a shredded blown out tire that will not grip the ground so it does not spin out of control while you're trying to remove it. Um, you can use an air ratchet, which I have, but if that seems to not work and the thing's wanting to spin on you still, or let's just say you don't have the ratchet, um, here's another way you can do it. You can wrap a chain around it and secure it with a lock or some kind of bolt or something. That way, when it pulls tight, it's not wanting to spin on you. Uh, trust me, I tried the board trick. That didn't work. Uh, so I did the chain. I busted out the impact, though, because they were so seized on there, even with the chain, my, my hand power... Um, just manual force was not busting off like three of them so I had to bust off three with the impact and that helps because it it works at that bolt and especially if they're rusty it, jiggle, it just helps free it the uh, impact of it so uh, yeah hopefully if you are trying this you can use your hand tools that you have if not you're gonna have to use a ratchet um, but I hope the train the chain advice helps because when I first started doing it, all I had was my hand tools and the thing was just spinning. I couldn't figure it out, I was scratching my head and I was like, I really don't wanna get the impact out. So try this out first and maybe that'll save you some time. Um, and yeah, this really applies to dual, dual axle trailers because once one is in the air, the other is the one touching the ground, not this one anymore because of the obvious blowout. Um, yeah, funny story, I was on my way to look at a truck and I'm glad I didn't get the truck because I got home to this and I thought, well, if I had a truck on there, the other ones might have went too. I honestly didn't know how bad they were getting. This one was put on new last year. You might take my advice on this too. Let's see. Oh yeah, here's one right here that's bad. So I think this one was similar on the other side. Um, yeah, definitely don't run that. I was dumb and I forgot to check. Apparently it got worse over the year that it was sitting out here and I didn't realize how bad they were. Um, that will blow out. This is the brand new tire. Not the other one. So yeah, if you have any dry rotting of any sort, make sure you take a spare. I was in a hurry didn't have the time <laughs> so I would have been stranded for sure but this tire over here I thought it had some cracking on it oh it does right there so that is a recipe right there for a blowout so yeah be careful out there um, run with the spare and this is my word of advice if you don't have a chain Cause that's all I was thinking was if I was on the side of the road or without my air ratchet, how I was going to change this. And if you don't have a ratchet, well then find the next best thing like a rope or um, anything that will fit down in that you can wedge down in there. Um, I'm almost positive if I had a long enough screwdriver, I could have made it work. But um, yeah, sometimes when you're in a bind, you got to just uh, figure things out and use that good old noggin so um the chain was the best thing i had laying around the house but yeah if you're on the road and you don't have that i would try a ratchet strap um anything just to keep those keep the tire from turning um you also want to keep in mind that the the strap might get cut so um yeah just don't hurt yourself <laughs> but i hope this video helps somebody thanks for watching